Hi all, uh, today we'll discuss on how we can exclude the child or grandchild products at the runtime. So my name is Suresh Vanjari. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're keen to learn on more, more velocity stuff, subscribe to the channel and click on the bell icon for new videos. So let's get started. I'm into a velocity orna and uh, we will go to the velocity product console and let's understand what is the product structure we are talking about. So uh, we have a, a product called holiday of a vendor, right? So when we look at this uh, product structure here, so we have a multiple uh, level of hierarchy here. Right? So uh, under the holiday offer, we have iPhone uh, protection plan and there is a, a simple plan, right? Under the simple plan, we have uh, uh, multiple uh, token text plan, hotspot, uh, Netflix, and the cloud storage. Now, in our scenario, so whenever whenever customer buys a holiday of a bundle, so they should they should be able to buy the Apple phone, the choice plan, protection plan, but choice plan should exclude the cloud storage, which is a child product under a simple choice plan, right? And this should get excluded only for mobile or holiday of a bundle, not, not the other products, right? So, okay, so before that, before making any changes here, so let's let's go ahead and create an order and let's see how it is uh, looking currently, right? So if I place an order uh, for holiday of a bundle, this product even it should show and then we'll modify it and we'll place the order. Okay, uh, I'm into an account. I'm adding holiday offer window. Right. So it has added holiday offer bundle. Let me collapse it. Under this, uh, we have iPhone. Under this, we have a plan. Plan is having the cloud storage. Right. And the protection plan. Now, uh, we need to uh, make a change to the uh, hierarchy. Right. Uh, at the uh, we need to exclude cloud storage when we buy it during a holiday offer. So let's go to Velocity product. Here is the, the product. Yeah. Now um, I'm in holiday offer bundle. So what I'll do is I will click here. I need to override mode is on. And then I need to exclude this particular item. Yeah. Now I'll go here, save it. We need to execute CMT. Right. So let's go ahead and create the another another order. Right. So holiday offer been added. And if you notice this, we we don't have a cloud storage, wherein the previous one, we had a cl cloud storage. The what change we made here is, so when we, um, when we are here, right, at the, at the design time, we have excluded that product, right? So when, when we you do uh, this mode on and there is a, like, you know, the exclude or include item, if it is already excluded, it will show that, you know, you need to include that item. Right? So this way, uh, if, if 
is any uh, requirement around uh, this type of uh, thing, you can exclude the child products or it, it mainly works on the, uh, uh, the requirement only may come around a grandchild. Reason being is that if, if you want to directly uh, add or remove the product, you can, uh, no need of excluding it there directly uh, one level down, right? You can directly remove it instead of excluding it. Yeah, so uh, this use case may help at the ground chain level and we can explode it from here and uh, that will fulfill our uh, business requirement. Thank you for watching.